Hi, good morning, afternoon here. Just completed making my uh, cascading gutter set. Hold on. Okay, the first gutter is already flushing. There's one water feed for the gutter to the topmost gutter. And since it's flushing, I'll just talk about that flushing first. So the first gutter is flushing into the second gutter. Once the level of the second gutter reach the flushing point, it will step, start to flush. So the first gutter uh, siphon is over here. And water will flow in into the second gutter where you have uh, another siphon and then it start to flush once uh, the water level have reached the flushing point okay so this will start to flush once the first gutter has been emptied this siphon will stop and the third gutter will flush Right, the first siphon has stopped. It's still emptying the second gutter into the third gutter. Okay. The third gutter will then flush into the fourth gutter. They are cascading nicely, one after the other. The water usage is actually equivalent to one gutter grow bit only, with a bit of a uh, inflow before the gutter uh, the flush cut off. Okay, so the third gutter is still flushing and filling in the final last gutter. The last gutter will have a siphon on the opposite end. And once the level has been reached, it will start to flush. It's coming to that level. Right. That's the fourth gutter grow bit flushing. The third gutter grow bit should stop flushing because it's almost empty yes it's empty now and it has stopped so with this cascading system water inlet will be only to the first uh, gutter grow bit and it will flush down into all the grow bit at the bottom this will ensure complete uh, drainage actually because there's no more water in input into the second third and fourth gutter so the the drainage or water drain is complete except for the first gutter where we have the constant water inlet so those are normal uh, thing that are going to happen that you always have a bit of water in the first gutter so that's about it uh, my new set that I'm making and this one is I'm using for planting strawberries uh, one more thing due to only one grow bit been used for water feed will have a lot of excess water so theoretically we can reduce the pump size so that's about 70% of the water is not used so water pump capacity can be reduced uh, as compared to four independent gutter grow bit. However, due to the height 
the um, feet head is a bit uh, higher I will require a slightly higher rating palm but the volume is significantly reduced uh, I should say it saves 50% at least the amount of energy required as compared to four individual uh, gutter grow bit so four individual gutter grow bit require about 30 watt and with this arrangement I probably can reduce the power to a 15 watt so it's significantly reduced and the, the limit is just uh, how high you can transport the water and how high you can reach uh, in terms of planting ideally it ideally I should recommend three steps because four steps is a bit too high for me and it's best also to make into like an A-frame where you have both sides of the uh, area that you can plant and effectively you have double the amount of uh, planting space but I do not have much space so I resort to only a half of an A-frame arrangement okay that's it for today I'm very excited with this new arrangement and the system has been working flushing very well and as mentioned this one is I'm going to use it only for strawberry plantings okay thanks for watching bye